To this end, the practice of incorrectly criminalizing the action of black people Ten is the precondition towards ending racism. Blacks can be racist, and the anti-racism struggle to be led by black, blacks only. In this way, idea that black people can be held criminally liable for simply responding to racism, an idea that the government hate crimes bill provides for, is eliminated. There's also a sobering recognition in the Black First Land First uh, Bill that the end of racism is only possible in the final analysis when the institutional basis that make individuals' acts of racism possible has been eradicated. And that, so long as society is organized within the reality of white power, racism shall continue to exist. So the purpose of today is to look at the two bills and go into detail as to why the Black First Land First movement has decided, no, we need an alternative bill to the bill that was suggested and is tabled in front of Parliament. So allow me to hand over to the National Convener of Black First Land First movement, who will be our first speaker. Thank you. Thank you, Comrade Manku. And I also want to recognize the leadership of our movement uh, from the provinces, in province in particular, and the regions, and uh, I know there's some people from the branches as well who are here. Our guests, some I meet uh, yesterday somewhere, and I said there's an event tomorrow, and I'm happy to see that uh, they are here. I'm also uh, quite uh, excited to have these uh, fellow panelists. These are two brothers that I respect a lot, and I think that they are ones, they're some of the people that have quite an elevated understanding of the problems that we are confronted with. Now, we are a country which has gone through 350 years of systematic racism, but at the same time, we seem to be a people which lacks a comprehensive understanding of the problem. Another time, a good comrade made an example of how it looks like we are under attack from a swarm of bees, but we don't know what bees are. So we have this attack, but you can't speak the problem. And we all now sitting this evening here, and I think also we must uh, appreciate that, uh, taking time out to reflect on a question such as this, uh, suggests that we are a people that take seriously the challenge of racism. But as we sit here today, we know that our people are at war amongst themselves. Our people are, are meddling each other, our people